We're trying every item in the June 2022 Keto Crate right after this. Hey guys, welcome to the June 2022 edition of Smash the Crate, the monthly series where normally my mother and my husband and I try every item in this month's Keto Crate. As you can see, Christina is not here today. She's busy, she be having things to do, but that won't stop us, okay? <laughs> We're gonna be trying every item in this month's Keto Crate. I'll eat for you, Chris. No, and you really won't. I'll eat for her. I mean, come on now. It, look, comment down below. Who's, I thought, I thought marriage is good. No, who's more likely to take two shares of what's going on here. Uh, okay, you can use the link in the description box below to get a discount on your very first Keto Crate or stick around to the end to see if you won this month's Keto Crate. Okay, let's jump right in. In case you want, no. <laughs> what is it like? No employees or relatives uh, of employees at the, the station. <laughs> That's why I haven't won. No. Oh my goodness. Okay, so this one's Keto Crate. I think it's a good mixture of sweet and savory. I like so, that. So you know me, we're gonna get all the savory oh out the way first, I was okay? Say, you are very sweet, a sweet lover. First. You're right. According to that's why I love you, cause you're so sweet. Come on, that has to count for something. Okay, so our tiering system, right? Tier one, it goes from first to worst. Tier one is great. I love this. Mm -hmm. This is delicious. I would pay for this with my own money. Like, wow, that's great. Tier two. You know what? That's really good. I wouldn't necessarily buy it, but if I were to receive it for free in like mm -hmm. a keto crate or somewhere, like I would be happy to receive that. Okay. Tier three. Yeah. Yeah. I don't love it, but like I'm not throwing it away. Yeah. Like it's something where it's if like, I accept I'll it, accept I'll put it. it in the back of the snack drawer, but I may not reach for it, but like at least I'm keeping it, right? Yes. Tier four is actively, no, I don't like that. I think that is gross. I would not accept it even if you gave it to me for free. Like I don't like that. Once again, just because we happen to rate something on our tier system, mm -hmm. everyone's tastes is subjective. There you know, you I, I'll always give meat sticks a tier three and he'll always give them a tier one. Like no just, ways. okay, a tier two at least. I just, mm, they're just not my thing, right? So, so if we don't happen to like the taste of something, that doesn't mean you might not like it. It's just like, hey, we're here to, you know, show you the real deal. There we go. All right. Diving in. Here we go. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna try is the spicy dill pork rinds Ooh. from Southern Recipe Small Batch. I've told them how we've had these before. Uh, the dill Actual ones. The dill? Yeah, the oh, spicy nice. dill. Yeah. I know. It's, Again, that's like salt and vinegar. It's that, it's that, it gives you that daily. That's what I was gonna say. That's why I don't like these aren't my favorite because they're sour like mm -hmm. salt and vinegar. Mm -hmm. But I mean, and dill. Don't get me wrong, but I just already know that it's the the sourness that's gonna be like ooh there that is. I like a punch. Alright, let's go. Oh my god. <laughs> Just like I remember. Oh yeah. Mm. Mm. That wonderful pickle pickly brine. I mean if you like dill flavored things you're gonna love that. I only like pickles. The sourness, the vinegariness is just, I can't get down with tier it. Tier one. Man, tier three, that is nuts. I don't like I those. I love those. Like, I love, Southern Recipe Small Batch has like the salt and pepper kind that I really like. They also have those like kimchi, Korean barbecue. Yeah, like they also have other flavors that I really like. Spicy dill is not it. Well, look at you eating mom share oh, of the, mm -mm, no. Mm -mm. That's for you, Chris. That's for you. Um, Yeah, tier three for me. Like I said, it doesn't taste bad, it's just, vinegary flavored would, things are not my thing. I would say tier one, but mm. not all the time. Yeah. It's mm. one of those things like tier one. If I was like, enjoying a deli day. sandwich. I like it, one of those meat roll up, meat and cheese. Yeah, like on, a, roll on a roll, up. yes. Okay, mm -hmm. very in a, in a deli mood. I, I feel that. Still keep it keto. Yeah. Next, we have Genius Gourmet mm. Keto Snack Chips Spicy these. Nacho. Exactly, right? I know these. We've seen these before. We've definitely seen the packaging before, so. <laughs> Only because it's okay. so much, the but, ratio. Yeah, but look to how thick these chips are. Mm. These chips are thick, thick. Yes. Yeah, so um, hopefully we'll like the Very spicy nacho. Too. Yeah, it's I definitely think, coated in some like stuff, them. so let's go. Mm. 
Q1. First of all, not spicy at all. Is this Here. spicy? Yeah. Oh, gosh. Try one of those. It's it not a, a regular great. nacho cheese flavor, but I like it. Wonderful that's perplexing. To me, that's a tier two. I mean, the texture is a tier one. Mm -hmm. I love how crunchy yes. and like thick it's and substantial they are. Chip bite. It is the perfect dipping chip, right? Mm -hmm. Flavor wise. I didn't even think about dipping it. Oh my gosh, that's a game changer. <laughs> That's a one plus To get you some sour cream dip, mm. like a, mm. I was thinking of your chicken buffalo. Oh, yeah, yeah. that would be good. Yeah, that's a dip. Yeah, but the flavor is just like, mm, I don't mind that. But it's just like not my absolute, I like, oh you. my God, that I was delicious. You. But it was, I mean, the texture. So they just changed the coating to something else. Yeah, maybe something stronger. But yeah. I mean, it was still good, but mm. like tier it. two, but I, I definitely it. think they're worth a try, I'll I would say. say. one plus. Yeah. Mm. You can dip it. Because <laughs> you can dip it. Next. Fat Snacks Ooh, Almond Flour Crackers. I'm loving this box so yeah, far. Yeah, we've had, that's because we're doing all the savory yeah, ones first. This is my best one. No. Um, okay, so okay. we've right. had these before. Have and we? yeah, we really, we Ooh. liked them. Because remember, oh, yeah, here. Because the, the look of them, they're like reminded us of Cheez Its, mm -hmm. but they were like more substantial. They mm. weren't like as crispy, like fried as Cheez Its, but they like were thicker. Okay, let's try. Okay. Mm. I know what you're talking about now. Wow. I think the cheddar flavor there is like and it's substantial. just as strong as a cheese. -up. It's very substantial. Mmm. Mm. That's delicious. That's a tier one. The aftertaste is a little bit. Tastes like different. cheese. I'm going to say a tier two mm. just because of that chip earlier was amazing. Comparatively. Yeah. Mmm. If I started on that one, see for me, I, I like that better. Than, I like the flavor of that better than the chip. I like the texture of the chip slightly better than this. I mean, this has a good texture mm -hmm. too, but you can't beat that crunchiness of the mm -hmm. chip. But exactly. hmm, that was really good. Well, I give that. I agree with that's a tier said. one. I, I really, really like that. Now moving into the sweet stuff. Okay, so the first thing we're not gonna try, but Ultima Replenisher. Wait, so no more savor. No more savor. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's so Ultima mean. Replenisher. Ooh. We have some electrolyte packets, right? So, so we'll this? just no, no, because there's too many, and we're not gonna try all of them. That's true. Yeah, and so, but let's see what try flavors. Them tomorrow. Let's see what flavors they have. As the week goes. They by. have grape, which mm. I don't know if I would like. I'll try it. Yeah, they have cherry pomegranate. I mm. definitely will try that. They have lemonade. There we go. I saw the cherry go. pomegranate and grape. There's a new mm, favorite. See blue raspberry. Oh, I am definitely yours. a fan that's of yours. the blue raspberry. I will say that's awesome. Pink lemonade. Ooh, you get lemonade, lemonade and collide. pink lemonade. Yeah. And raspberry. Oh, so you get two sweet. types of raspberry. Okay. Definitely a fan of those. I like it. Well, I'm just looking you, at now you're just going <laughs> to drop them off. You're just going to spill them off. <laughs> Okay, so I like the flavor of these. They're not as sweet as Zip Fizzes, mm -hmm. but like that's the point, right? They're exactly. not, they don't use the sweeteners only, that make it as sweet, right? Stuff. Yeah, so these are really good to have. That's um, awesome. I would say out of the flavored mm -hmm. sweetened electrolytes that you can get, mm -hmm. these are tier ones, That's right? Awesome. Yeah, there's other well, kinds out there. I really like these. These are my go-to. If I'm not having Zip Fizz, it's Ultima. It's the Ultima. Yes, yeah. love it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Next. <gasps> I know those. Yeah, sweetened with xylitol we ice met chips. Them in candy. Las Vegas. We did meet them ah, in Las Vegas. Key yeah. to Las Vegas. Love. I, don't know if that's happening I didn't realize they had so many flavors. That's awesome. But this is berry mix. So remember we had the peppermint? Yeah. We had the lemon. No, remember at the stand, he had like hundreds of flavors. That's what I'm saying. They had 20s of flavors. 20s of flavors. Yeah, I didn't realize they had so many. Berry mix is one of them. Okay. Oh, I love anything berry. Yeah, so as I said, hopefully this is sour, maybe or like a Let's sweet see. tart, maybe. These two. So yeah, if you look at it, they're little, they're called oh. ice chips for a reason because oh. they look like chips of ice, right? They're so cute. So they're not colored at all. Mm -hmm. I don't think any of them, nope, regardless of the aren't. flavor. Yeah. They so this is not. just like like I said, melted and flavored xylitol. Let's go. I love it. I love all of these. I'm not gonna move. Mm. Cute one. Sweet tart. Cute one. <laughs> no. Cute one. I knew what this was the moment I saw it. Mm. Take one more. Okay. <laughs> it's just like oh a sweet You ain't lying. It's candy. Mm, it's perfect candy. Yeah, I would not. I don't need that now. <laughs> yeah. I don't need that now. The only bad thing 
about it is that, babe, the serving size is like two of these. Like, oh, this no. is a serving. Oh, no. 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 Mm-mm. Mm. My problem was if the bag was bigger, that'd be more of a problem. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh, tier one. It is berry. It is sweet. It Wait, is what tart. What did you compare it to? Sweet tart. There we go. It's a sweet Boom. tart. Mmm. No, ice chips are amazing. Mmm. Mm. Yes, ice chips are amazing. And there's so many flavors. Have not run into a flavor that I don't like. Like, and we had a lot of them in Vegas. They're so good. Mmm. I love it. Mm. Tier one. We're love it. it out. Yes. Mm. Okay. Next. See, these are good sweets. Yes. I'm sure you'll love this. Lemon poppy Yay! seed. No. Lemon poppy seed. Mm, mm, Chipmunk. Mm, 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 mm. You had me at lemon. Mm, yeah. Mm, you had seed. my husband We're, we're taking the roller coaster on poppy seed. Um, uh, I mean, I feel like poppy seeds are just more for texture exactly. and look versus actual well, flavor. Gotta lean into but y'all let me know. So, okay. So here's what it looks like. Oh. It's just your typical soft almond flour cookie. It does. You can definitely Looking see the poppy thing. seeds. You see the bits. Yeah. There you Thank go. You, babe. <clears throat> okay. It's very thick. Oh, she thick. All right, let's go. Mm. Very moist. Getting a punch of lemon instantly. Mm-hmm. Mm, that's not bad. Mm. And I'm saying that might be pretty perfect when you follow it behind the ice chips yeah. because that's like a nice tamper down. Yeah. It's definitely, mm. it's lemon, but mm. it's not tart. And it's not exactly. super duper sweet. Mm. Chipmunk. Okay. That's okay. That's a tier one and a half, actually. Yeah. I was just gonna say. I didn't one, think I was gonna I like I'm that. Ones yeah. This all over the place. This I didn't thing. think I was gonna like that that much. Who wants a one? It doesn't really have. Let me see. Does it have a erythritol in it? It just has allulose, I think. Because, like I said, it doesn't really have. It tasted amazing. And monk fruit, of course. It doesn't have a like a cooling oh, effect. No. Like every time I see this cookies like, like this. I get nervous that they're just going to be very gritty and have a cooling effect. And this one didn't. No, this Look no. At you. Mm -mm. That, that's really good. So. I mean, I would. Ooh. If you like lemon poppy seed flavored things, I eating the whole I, thing. yeah, I really think you'd love that. Okay, next, <gasps> love Good we... Fats, chewy, nutty, dark, chocolatey, cranberry, and we almond. We love love Good Fats. We really do love love Good Fats. That sounds kind of redundant. Yeah, that's but... a lot of love, but we love love Good Fats, and especially their chewy, nutty. Oh my gosh! Bars. Yeah, look that at that. Looks them. legit. Yeah. Look okay. At this. this is exciting. You pass the eye test. Yes, like exactly. An eyeball, an amazing bar. Oh my gosh, it is um, very. Tough. Not, I mean, not in a bad way. Like, if you were to bite into this, yeah. it would be amazing. It's one of those, to, like, uh, trying to break it apart. A trail. Yeah. Oh, Lord. Kind of it's a trail meets yeah, bar. Okay. So, it's, yeah, you got a piece okay. with the cranberry yeah, right there. Perfect. I'm going to take a piece with the cranberry. With the chocolate. Look yeah, definitely that. the chocolate coating bottom. Definitely here for I that. Mean, okay, let's go. I think I know what I'm going to vote on this one. Mm. Mm. It's so chewy. Mmm. The cranberries, though. And if Chris was sitting here, mm -mm. two ones. Mm, I guess it's one for me, your too. Your mother would love this. Yeah. I'm eating for you, Chris. Stop thinking. It's so hard. <laughs> I mean, it's exactly as I expected. I said, the almonds are going to be crunchy. The chocolate is going to be sweet. Mm -hmm. But the cranberries are going to be like sour, like tart. And chewy, and, and then you mix them. That's together. exactly what that is. That is delicious. One's a fist. That, <laughs> what? <laughs> that is a tier one. I mean, yeah, that that is a tier I agree. one. Yeah, you mm. nailed it. <clears throat> That's amazing. Really good. Okay. Love good fat. Okay, finally, Catalina Crunch oh, keto-friendly uh, sandwich cookies. Okay, let me get these away from you. No, as I was saying, y'all know. Oh my god! Imagine how excited I was on the unboxing where I was like, "Oh I was say, my I'm god!" Just try not to eat the boxes with. Well. I know. Hell, maybe, I'm gonna have to save some of these for mom. Chunk missing out. I'm gonna yeah, I'm gonna have to save some of these. You for don't mom. have to. She'll see it on the video. <laughs> She'll watch. <laughs> She'll watch with everything. Now, if mom commented, maybe she could win. <laughs> you can't. You can't be present and. And win the keto. No, see, there you go. That's smart. Mm. So I'm out of here. This looks great. Oh my god, these look great. Like typical, what I would expect from Oreos. No, no, don't drop any now. Let no, me. no. Okay. Ooh. 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 That happened. Oh, I, that. I, 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 I thought you noticed. <laughs> I did not notice that they were upside down. The holding tray. It was upside down. 
I do love sliding it out of the little packaging. Look at the little boat of cookies. It's a cook, it's a cookie boat. Yeah. Okay. It's a super indulgent. Okay. And I'm here for it. Okay, so comment down below. Back in our Oreo eating days, did you just bite into the cookie, oh, no. or did you twist it and take one well, side I off? I twisted it, but for different reasons. What did you because do? Because I couldn't have that many. So I would twist you it. You have to make it last longer. One cookie turns. Like, hey, it's science. <laughs> when you only get two cookies, exactly. which, is, which is a serving. Now I got more. Yes, that is so I'm funny. Like, hey, for a different reason. Okay, comment down below. First of all, did you twist and separate or did you bite right in? Secondly, when you twisted and separated and the cream would go on one side and just the cookie on the mm -hmm. other, which side did you eat first? Did you eat the cream the side cream or the cookie only. side? What? You licked the cream off. You lick the cream off? No, you use your teeth and you scrape it what? off. What? Mm. So you eat the cream by itself? Mm -hmm. No. Yeah. No, you literally have the cream covered cookie and then the plain cookie. You eat the plain cookie and then like you savor the cream cookie, but together. Ooh, I should have grew up Because then it's like a double stuff because you only have one oh side, but gosh, the regular. We, I went too fast and ate the nougat. Oh my God. It's not the... nougat. No, it okay, see, just like this, just <laughs> like what I did here. The cream came off, and then you have the naked cookie. Yes. Okay, so I'm just going to eat the naked cookie. Okay. Mmm. Oh. Mm. First of all, the texture is amazing. Mm. Okay. Now I'm biting into the cream shop. Mm. Yeah, this is... Mm. <laughs> I don't even know anymore. Whoa! Mm. You guys... <laughs> This is regular food. This is a upper Oreo. Like, just really I mean, this be careful with your snack. Sugar. You know, those are amazing. I'd have to agree. Texture-wise, those are amazing. I'd Ingredients definitely giving you the side eye. Definitely, because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. the very first ingredient is palm fruit oil. Oh no! Yeah, <laughs> like, but no wonder it tastes so delicious. It's using conventional ingredients. I would not have seen that coming. Yeah, you know. Yeah. Yeah, th that's why it tastes just like a regular thing because it's made with the same ingredients that those typical, mm -hmm. you know, snacks are made that's from, right? You, so you hide it. Mm -hmm. You hide it good. So just because it's sugar free, like still, still think about all the rest of your ingredients. Exactly. Well, I think the key is it says keto friendly. friendly. But is it like, is it is it human body friendly yeah. if you're eating palm fruit yes. oil? Let, let's just think about that, right? Mm. But it tastes delicious. So, like, I'm not going to deny that yeah, fact. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. We're definitely getting rid of these right so, now. So, weird. <laughs> but do you know who else? Like, do you know who I want? Like, I want to I want to know how they, like, feel about this thing. Mm -hmm. Like, the yeah. person that won this one's Keto Crate. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That person is. Mmm. Look at this. Oh, wow. You get some Catalina Crunch coming this to you. Ain't my name. No, oh, it's not you. <laughs> this is not Richard. Um, this crate is, I mean, this crate is great. It has a it bunch really of savory, is. a bunch of wow, sweet, a whole package of sandwich cookies. I mean, that's like three snacks. And I did say, I was like, this is a large bag of pork rinds. Like, this was going to keep you satisfied for a very long time. So send me an email to watchautumnketo at gmail.com. And we will get this over to the folks at Keto Crate. They're going to send yeah. you your crate out in the mail. Super easy. Whoa, this was delicious. I'm so sad mom couldn't be here. Oh, uh, man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're just, we're, I was trying to be polite, but no, we're being honest. Like, no, that's more oh snack for me. You know what I'm talking so about? Oh, oh, my gosh. This was amazing. And I look forward to next month. Bye. <laughs>